What's up, guys? Welcome to local band Smokeout. Smokeout. Any genre from, from anywhere in the entire world. I want to hear your music. All right, well, let's uh, let's just make it official. He'll get in here when he gets in here. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, the dude! Yes! Brian, do me a favor, properly introduce yourself. Uh, let us know where in the bounce of the world you are right now and plug and promote anything and everything. Uh, yes, uh, I am uh, Brian, uh, a.k.a. Monkey Boy. Uh, I am from the band The Dude, and we are from Sarasota, Florida. I am actually in Ocala, Florida, where I reside uh, amongst the woods. Ocala, Florida. I, I actually used to live in Ocala. I used to go to uh, a Full Sail in Orlando, which is like right in the cusp of Orlando. I graduated from Full Sail myself. Really? That's really? awesome. Yes. Recording arts? Recording arts. Recording arts, yes. Hell yeah. What a small yeah. world. That, that's cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm born and raised yeah, in, in West Palm Beach. In West Palm Beach. Right on. Hell right yeah. on. So we got we got Rudy joining us, but uh, but Rudy, we can't see you. We can't hear you. We can't hear you. Uh, well, let's see. Uh, maybe he's not. Um, well, he's probably trying to figure it all out. No worries. How no did worries. you How did you guys come up with? Oh, now we can hear Rudy. I'm just a voyeur. He's just a voyeur. You can you you can voyeur from uh, from anywhere, I guess. Uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah. So uh, how are you, BG? I, I am fantastic. Chad is suggesting if there is a way to mute the stream, mute it, to, which would stop the delay. But I'm, I'm great, dude. You guys are here partying. Uh, I want to know how you came up with, like, was the idea for the band name to come up with the dude first and then figure out what it stands for? Um, actually, no. Uh, the the dude, I, I didn't come up with the name. Uh, Ray and Jonesy did. Um and they got it from a rip old Ripley's Believe It or Not book. Uh, it's actually the Distinguished Order of Disobedience, and which was a medal that was given in Austria to uh, soldiers who won a battle by disobeying a direct order. That is metal and as f dude. That is awesome. It is. It is. <laughs> and, then, and, and then as it went along... Uh, we realized everybody realized that nobody could spell the distinguished order of disobedience. So it was uh, it, it, it turned out to make it easier just to go to the dude, uh, and uh, that works. That t it totally uh, I, works. Are, are is there still a delay thing or are we good? Test test. No, it's it's one hundred percent fixed. Okay, one hundred one hundred percent fixed. I I had my speaker on so I could hear you, but then I'd put on the headphones and it seemed maybe that's the deal. I'd that off that I think that solved it. Deal. That solved it right there. How long have you guys been together? Is it still the OG lineup? Have members been in and out? What's... Um, well, uh, the band formed somewhere around 2004. Uh, so, uh, and that was uh, starting out with uh, Rainus and Jonesy uh, in there. I joined up as the singer of, uh, Somewhere around uh, 2014, I think it was. Um, so they were already a band for quite some time before I came along. Uh, and um, they just became a better band because I showed up. And then, uh, <laughs> no, that's not true. Actually, they had some great people in there. It just uh, once, I once, once I showed up and uh, we started doing, um, you know, playing, doing more tours and doing, you know, more albums and, 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 and such. So, uh, and uh, recently uh, with a recent, our most recent member is Rudy, uh, who is here somewhere um, and, and just a voyeur. Um, but- uh, Good evening, gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, he was the, uh, um, he, he was the most recent member. He joined uh, during the recording of the Firefly album that we had. That was our last album that was put up. Uh, and uh, he actually didn't play on it 
but he learned it and did all the touring for it. And uh, we loved him so much, we had to keep him. He's perfect. When you find a good and, one, you uh, got to you got to wrap him up and and, and make sure they're they're with in you. In between the in between me and, and Rudy, there was Indy, who uh, um, we we've had several guitar players, but Indy's been with us for I don't know four or five years now, and just I mean. Right now, I feel like we have the best lineup we've ever had, uh, and uh, I, I, it's the one we're going to keep and probably die with on stage. Bleeding. We got a we got a, a, a chat question. If it's okay, how has sure, it been certainly. being a part of all the Space Zebra DWP stuff? Oh, those guys are awesome. First off, uh, those guys were the, the all. Uh, they were really fun to work with. Uh, it was a little hectic when we were doing this whole uh, the 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 video uh, wars for Rockville or whatever it was, uh, because you had to come up with a new video every week, and we had a back catalog. But after a while, it seemed like it was a lot of weeks because like we <laughs> ran out of videos, and so that was pretty hard. But it but we wound up going to uh, welcome to Rockville and playing there, and that was an awesome time. And those people were have always been really really nice damn people I, I i gotta say and very friendly very kind and and very supportive very cool hell yeah were you informed about the hot sauce today for the trivia portion i was but unfortunately i have a stomach issue this week that is that and it, i know it sounds like it's that's okay we can compromise you know, with something it, else what about uh a beer swig or, or something like that instead of hot sauce. Uh, we could do that. Cool. I could, I could possibly do that. All right. So the cool thing about the trivia is I'm going to let you, Brian, pick the trivia topic. Rudy, you are allowed to jump in and answer the question if you know it. But I, you got to give me a minute or two to look up the trivia. But I need to know if there's a movie or TV show that you guys could agree on that you've seen so many times. If I look oh, no. up this movie or TV show, there is no way I would stump you. Um, uh, I I don't I can't speak for them because I know I'm the guy who watches the movies and the TV shows, uh, and I don't know. Like, I mean, I think I mean if we go with like an Avengers movie, we could probably all get on the same page. Uh, So, Rudy, what are you thinking? I'm thinking maybe like a classic Stephen King movie. I think we've all <laughs> seen those numerous times. So, well, like, could you name? Can you name one? Like, I'll, like I'll The Shining, or or something like that, or or like uh, a Pet Cemetery? Is that kind of what you're thinking? Uh, the Shining, for sure. The Shining. Okay, I'm good with it. So on a night on a night like Welcome to Rockville, I'm imagining after after the gig, huge huge success, some merch sales, new fans, etc. What what is the the munchy meal celebration like after a big awesome show like that? What are you guys partying? Uh, <laughs> um, Rudy, you want to go with that? Waffle House. Oh it's man, always, there's no Waffle Houses in California, dude. I miss it's, Waffle it's, House. It's almost always Waffle House, and then uh, at the time for myself, it would be Waffle House, and then you take some food to go, and you go and you drink Jameson wherever you're staying, and uh, it makes for a good night. I'm sure it uh, did. Big old fat stack right there with some syrup. Yes. <laughs> oh. So, so if, Brian, if you want to grab the, uh, the the beer, whether or not you get the trivia right or wrong, I'm going to do hot sauce. I have uh, some, I just have it right next to me, Tabanero Triple X. But I have the trivia right. ready if, if you need to go grab uh, the brewski. Yeah, if you could give, give me just a moment. Sure. Uh, I will be right back. Rudy, while I have you for a second, sir, may I ask, what is your favorite song in the set to play and why? I would have to say probably Back of Hell. Uh, when we first started with that song, it didn't, didn't really, it, it was hard for me to kind of see and visualize its inception and how it was going to go. And that song just got legs and it's a banger. I mean, that's probably the one I enjoy playing the most. 
Is it, it? Would you find that the fan favorite is Subterfuge, or or is there a particular one that the fans are always screaming like, "You guys gotta play this one." I have right. to say something over pretty well, so that I think uh, normally uh, we start our with that, and, uh, and normally pretty much engaged after that song. So yeah, gotcha. Subterfuge for sure. Cool. All right, you ready, Brian? I got a Bud Light. Ready. I got a Bud Light. I've got a Miller Light. That'll here. work. Gentlemen, you got to pick the trivia. Here we go. All right. In The Shining. We're only going to do two questions total. Don't worry. In The Shining. What type of car does Jack own? A piece of shit. Does that count? It doesn't count. Let's see if Rudy can get it, but it is... Yeah, I would call it that. But, uh, Rudy, what you got? Uh, I thought in the book it was a gremlin pacer. but I can't Yeah, I think it's a gremlin. Okay, so I guess I didn't specify if it was the movie or the book. There might be two different vehicles. I'd have to That's confirm. Okay. Uh, Rudy, do you know the movie version? It's seen in the very beginning of the film before they get to the hotel, like they're driving up to the hotel. Maybe a Ford Continental is all I can think of right now. We're drinking, Brian! <laughs> all right. It is a yellow uh, bug. Yellow bug. Volkswagen bug. A punch buggy. Woo! All right. All right. I'm drinking, by the way. It's a traditional I, lager. Uh, cheers. R r r okay, Yingling. All right, good. Now, I know it was release day. Uh, what what can you guys tell us about the rest of 2024 that we have to look forward to from the dude and beyond? I know sometimes you can't tell us okay. every little detail. So it's all timing based, blah, blah, blah. But what are you guys allowed to tell us? Um, uh, I can tell you. Oh, there they are. Who we, got, in the lock. who we got here? Hey, that's Jonesy. That's Jonesy right there. What up, Jose? I hear the fan background noise, but uh, we appreciate you joining, Jonesy. Hey, Trump fan. All right, we're working on it. No, no worries. It's a birthday party. <laughs> it's a birthday party. It is, it is in fact, Reynas' birthday. So the first thing you can uh, count on for this year is Reynas' birthday, which is right now. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, it's you live in the flesh and stuff. How are you? 27. 27 are <laughs> so good. Woo! 27. 27, man. Why would I pick 27? I don't know. I don't know. There's 27 cool clubs. That's, that's, that's right. That's where all the cool rock stars die. 27. All right. All right. All right. Good. Good. <laughs> good. Um, so what do we got coming up? Um, well, we obviously today we, we just released... Um, 2,000 miles, um, and then, and then uh, next month we uh, will be releasing, and I do not know the date off the top of my head, I'm sorry, but I will, uh, I, it will be certainly posted on our website, uh, thedudeband.com. Next month we will have uh, the video for uh, 2,000 miles. Uh, right. Past that, we're... So well, how, well, how do you feel about that video, man? Are you uh, confident on your uh, your videography your AI skills? skills? We'll, we'll be okay. Don't okay. worry. I, I like it. Double thumbs up. Double thumbs up. Double thumbs up. All right. Confidence. I love America. All right. Uh, <laughs> America. America. All right. So, um, but after that, uh, we've got in August, we will be releasing one more single. Uh uh, for a song called Final Girl. Girl. Final Girl. Final Girl, yes, in, in August. What does that refer to? Uh, that is referring to uh, horror movies. Uh, the Final Girl in horror movies, It's it, that's what it refers to. Right. Um, so it's a horror music video, too, going to be accompanying it? Uh, you'll have to wait and see. But, yeah, there's... There will, it most likely uh, will most not be likely. about duckies. Most likely will not be about duckies and bunnies. 
Gotcha. Uh, so uh, we'll, we'll <laughs> definitely have it's, it. I think it's going to be a sequel to our video for horror show. So if you haven't seen that, kids, go check it out on YouTube. It's a good thing. Um, wow. And and uh, then in September, we put out uh, the whole shebang, the whole album. Uh, it's called Dissonance. Um, and uh, that's September 17th. And there is... It's about an eleven-track album, um, and uh, yeah, and it's gonna be, it's, it's it's approximately an hour long, an hour worth of new music, and it's gonna be great. Yeah, uh, yeah. we're um, we're heading to Kentucky at the end of this month. Uh, we're going to be playing uh, Skullfest on the 29th. I'm about to ask about Skullfest. And- How excited are you guys for that? Oh, I'm we're very so excited. excited. We're very excited. <laughs> Oh <laughs> uh, yeah! Can you uh, please explain yeah. the wheel? I would like to know more about the wheel. The wheel. Okay, so there's a wheel behind me, and then there's a wheel that we have on the screen, which I can okay. show you guys right now. You, if you look at the screen, so uh, I ask a lot uh, of trivia. If you get the trivia correct, so I'm gonna ask you one more trivia question. We're doing the shining trivia, which Rudy got to pick, um, and if he gets it right. You, uh, Brian does not have to drink a sip of his beer or Rudy. Instead, we're going to spin the wheel. Whatever it lands on, I have to do. What you want it to land on Ooh. is spin the big wheel because that's what, that could land on, like, I mail you merch. Um, you automatically get in one of our tournaments, which is probably the most exposure this channel has as far as Twitch stuff. All right, let's do it. All right. All right, so you want the trivia. Let's do it. Rudy, they're counting on you, bro. Here we go. <laughs> In the Shining movie, where is Dick when he gets the cry for help from Danny? Anyone can answer. He's in Florida. That is correct! Hell yeah, hell yeah. You get to spin the wheel! The spinning of the wheel. Chat cannot see the wheel at the moment, but we will let them know what it lands on. Landon and hot sauce. I already have to do the hot sauce. To me, to me, dude, that is not fair. That is not fair. That is shit. So we're gonna spin it again. So. Gotta do a shot, a sake shot. I love some sake. You guys, you guys ever party on some sake? Oh yeah. Sake. Uh, I don't yeah. think we've done it as a band. Only twice. Well, twice. well, cheers to maybe the third, the maybe the third time, time in the future. Cheers to you. Have you guys ever thought about having like a big time artist as a feature, maybe to project the numbers to the next level? No. Um, I am. Um, we, uh, there was I, one I, point in time on our album Buttercup, we were going to have, uh, the guitar player from Mushroom Head was, we were talking to him about doing a, 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 a lead on, on, uh, our, one of our songs, Tapophobia. Uh, but unfortunately the timing just did not work out, uh, for it. So was gonna do that job. that's, that's Waylon. Is that correct? That that's Waylon? Uh, no, he was, he, he was in Mushroom Head. He was one of the same. Oh, okay. He's a former, former. Yeah. Right. Former Mushroom Head. He was the same. I, I, I'm sorry. I'm blanking on the name. Indy would know. Like, of course he would. But Indy well, is, uh, I unfortunately. Have, I have thought about, like, uh, you know, Kelly Schaefer. I think it's my song. Who did you say? Kellen? Like, Kellen? Somebody? Kelly Schaefer from a from the band Atheist. Um, Not just and fill the dirt. Fill the dirt. Neurotica. He's been in a bunch of great bands. Hell yeah. Some some true metal. Yeah. Um, who's who's your who's your surprise cameo, Brian? You got a surprise cameo to your left. Oh, that is uh, that is Dexter. He's a very old man. What uh, up, Dexter? Dexter. And, uh, yeah, he, 
Does he have plastic laid on the floor behind you? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> He's gotten too old for his serial killing. And now he just lives lives with me and gets fed a lot. Serial killing. I got a couple more questions for you guys and then and then we'll we'll let you go. I appreciate your time. How did you how did you find uh how did you find Eric and how did you link up with him? Oh Eric, um we met Eric uh through a friend a mutual friend of ours, um who uh Tom from Outlaw Entertainment, uh and um and it was a few years back. We were going up. We were going on tour, and we needed a show in Kentucky. And he hooked us up, and uh, we we never actually got to meet him at, at that point in time. But I did talk to him briefly then, and then later on, while we were looking for uh, a little bit of uh, uh, help with doing the PR stuff and putting together a lot of, a lot of different things, once again Eric's name came up. So uh, I checked him out, and he's been doing a, a fantastic job. Hell yeah, he's such a cool dude, man. Good, good homie for sure. He's a great guy. Well, uh, uh, is oh, I'm sorry, Jonesy. I didn't mean to cut you off. Have you listened to the album? I've heard uh, a handful of songs. Absolutely, I have not heard uh, obviously anything that's coming out in August. I saw the video. What was it yesterday? The day before for for Pentecostal. Uh, yeah. I'm I'm a huge fan of Subterfuge. So I I know I know a handful of your guys' stuff for sure. Otherwise, I wouldn't know what I'm doing in this interview, so I, I gotta be prepared. Uh, <laughs> Alright, check out Firefly. Firefly? Yeah. Okay. The album Firefly. Really good album. Uh, that was produced by Matt LaPlante, uh, who's like done Nonpoint and Seven Dust yep. and a bunch of others. And uh, it was a lot of fun working with him for that album, and uh, it, the album's really interesting. Uh, so it, it's, it's, it's a good listen. Yeah. Is there is there anything that we did not discuss today that you guys want to bring up or plug or promote before we let you go? Um, Josie? Come no. see us live! Yes, come see us live. Catch a show! Buy some merch! Definitely. And uh, make sure you check out... He's hands on you and stuff! Uh, once again, make sure you check out the new single for 2,000 Miles, streaming anywhere, anywhere you want to get your music. Uh, and, um, you know, uh, keep your eyes out, because uh, go to the dudeband.com. We're always uh, updating that, and we're constantly uh, doing something new, and we're always going to be somewhere new. Uh, you know, there's a lot of different stuff that we got coming up uh, this year that I can't really say yet, because it's not fully announced. But sure. once it is, it'll be right there. So, and BG, want to say you do a great job with those reaction videos, bro. Great job with those reaction videos. We love them. Much love. I'm going to tell Eric to make sure he drops some of your guys' links in chat right now. Facebooks, Instagrams, all that stuff so everyone can follow it and show some love. Uh, or if you guys get a second, please it, throw it in the in the live chat. But uh, check out 200 Miles streaming now. We've got, uh, you said, a, a, a maybe a horror movie music video coming in august i believe you said brian yeah yeah okay uh, uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna spoil alert it will have to do with horror movies for sure it will have to do with a horror movie excellent uh I, and 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 next month there will be the video for 2000 miles uh for uh for that but you can check out the lyric video for 2000 miles right now on youtube perfect well guys this is a lot of fun i appreciate you brian Jonesy, hey, thank Ru you. Rudy, and I did not get your name. I'm sorry. Jonesy and Ray. That's and Ray. Greatest. Ray, that I appreciate you. Thank you as well. You guys are awesome. If it's okay with you, I'm going to throw this on YouTube tomorrow. I'm going to a gig tonight, so I might be tomorrow afternoon. But if that's okay oh, with you, I'll, I'll shoot you guys the link so we can we can share it around. But uh, this is Super a lot of fun, sweet. man. You guys, you guys rule. Uh, I, I oh, hope God. to catch a show sometime, so please come to California. I, I visit Florida every now and then, so I'll reach out if I'm ever in in your area. Uh, when I visit, I, right, I, go, I, I go to Palm Beach, but uh, uh, occasionally I hit Jacksonville, so we'll see. We travel. Oh, so don't worry. All right, word. <laughs> well, you guys rule. Please support him. TheDudeBand.com. Ladies and gentlemen, the dude. Yeah, hell yeah. You guys rule. Thank you again. I appreciate it. Much love, bro. Cheers. Yeah.